Hello everyone, this is Satvik and in this video, I will show you how you can analyze an email. Okay, so without getting any delay, let's start. So guys, before starting the video, if you are new to this channel, do check out my previous videos as well. And also, if you really like them, do subscribe and please like this video so that YouTube will understand that you are liking this content and it will promote this video to the more people so let's dive into the video so if you ask me what is the reason for email header analysis like we have been using mails from different service providers like google microsoft uh, proton mail and etc 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 and we'll be getting some bunch of mails every day okay and do you do you really know that the mail that you got is really secure or not but by the end of this video, you'll definitely know that uh, you'll definitely know whether the email you got is from trusted source or not. OK, so let's dive into the video and I'm showing this on a Gmail guys. OK, popular mail. OK, so and I'm taking this a simple uh, mail, which is from Hacker One. I think you might know a Hacker One, a bug bounty platform. So first of all, whenever you want to analyze a header, uh, you need to find out the header right and also guys this process of analyzing the email header comes under a topic called digital forensics so the forensic of officers will analyze the head analyze the mails okay from a incident okay so let's find out the uh, email headers uh, of our gmail it is really simple guys here uh, here you can see a three line three dot menu simply click on that and also click on that show original okay and now you can see some information out there uh, let me click on this copy to clipboard okay and if you simply type for if, if you simply search for email header analysis header analysis online you will be finding some bunch of tools and i will be showing you some cool tools that you need you can use okay the first one is the mx toolbox uh, which is really cool and simple it is straight uh, straight to the point let me so if you want to do analysis you need to provide the email header simply paste the thing that you copied simply click on analyze the header and this is also a fastest tool out there and you can see some information regarding spf and dkim so as both spf and dkim uh, provides the assurance that the domain which they are sending suppose in our case it is hacker hacker1.com okay so this record show that the hacker1.com is a verified resource okay verified domain so that if it is if it is uh fine then you can trust that it's it came from a particular or a correct domain like it haven't been spoofed and there is some more technical data do check that out okay uh signature you can see some signatures out there okay and you can see some detailed information like uh, whom it is delivered to uh, smtp source okay the source and it is received to authentication dkm signature and stuff 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 like that okay what is the message id and feedback also so that's the basic thing guys okay uh, where you can do email header analysis and make sure you learn spf and dkim so these are important terms in smtp or in the mail protocols okay do check that out or if you want to make me video on that uh, ask me comment below okay and this is a normal application this is like straight point like a point to point okay like you can find whether the email is trusted or not okay and there are some more tools like this is an import i like this tool much like mailheader.org simply click on that and this is also straightforward but it's it provides you more details simply paste your header that you copied there and simply click on submit let's see what happens it will provide some bunch of information to us which is really helpful let me zoom this a little bit and you can see whom it came from and whom it is to and also the subject and stuff okay the time it sent the content uh, and the encoding it is using it is the message id which is unique you can verify that out as well it came from amazonsec.com from aws most probably 
and also a mail server from so hacker one is using this particular mail server and mx.google.com since we are on gmail.com this is our mail server and it is from the ip from which ip and to the which ip so this is my public ip and also uh, you can see something like where it came from and where it delivered to and this is not my ip guys this is the ip of my mx.google.com okay and the names out there the services names and stuff out there it is, it is also showing the encryption it is poor uh, like it is also showing the global information like it came from here to here and then from here my uh, client downloaded that okay and spam scoring it is showing that no spam it is good okay so you can also verify the spam by using this method op details and these are some more details you can find and you can see the complete header over here like it is also checking for the viruses okay so there is no virus so it is showing that pass and as always you can see some signatures and signatures is used to verify the authentication and and also to provide some integrity to your data like not to be modified on the fly okay and you can see the complete email header once again here so this is this provides some more information compared to that of mx tool and you can also report some of the bugs if spf record is not there you can report it on some uh, some websites okay sometimes it is considered as uh, out of scope okay but sometimes it's not and there is something like uh, there are some more tools as well guys so, and this the one is also from the google apps.com let me open this thing like this is not so effective but uh, you can use that like more the tools you have more information you have like paste the thing and simply click on analyze the header above here you can see that uh, it's showing looking for the records spf spf and d d dkim and dmark and it is showing that it is passed okay so if you are finding everything in green then it is passed and whom it came from and whom it had received to okay and there are some bunch of tool guys like many more tools okay, you can simply analyze that okay you can simply analyze the mail you can simply paste it and the one i'm showing you is a trusted and i'll also show you on a spoof mail as well uh, so so that's it guys it provides the same information okay let me close all these things once again and now let me go back to a, a spam mail where we'll be getting some tons of spam out there like nowadays people are getting uh, people are getting lots from uh, what you call dating sites and stuff okay you are not on antivirus the payment verification four thousand dollars so yes let's try this out okay so it is asking me for the checkout for the payment verification okay i don't know what this is also like okay it is providing me some four thousand dollars okay who provides us for free so let's try to uh analyze this thing okay so as always click on this three line menu three uh, dot menu click on show original show copy and also guys if you get some mails like this uh, regard these are some spoofing mails so if you verify that it will be asking you for some money and they'll definitely that's nothing but cheating okay i copied the header guys now we'll go with email header analysis the first one is with the mailheader.org so this is much more useful compared to the previous let me paste the thing that i copied let me click on submit let's see what we are having out there it's taking some time which means that uh, so you can see the data over here it came from itljopk.uk which is which looks really suspicious okay the content over there it came from france empty encryption is good it is also showing that the mail header is a possible spam okay and also some more information uh, spam administration and stuff okay you can also look into the geolocation latitude and the longitude you can drag them out if possible like if you click on that it will be taking you to the google maps 
let's see what it is showing and where it came from as it told it's from france let's check that it's from france okay uh, they, they can also spoof that it can be always france as well let me close this thing and by this we can conclude that it is a spam mail and we'll also check out some various tools as well from the google also uh, toolbox.googleapps.com uh, let me paste once again let's see what we are having it is not showing whether it is spoof or not okay like it is spam or not sorry but yeah it is showing some information neutral like spf record is not there dkm record is not there also you can try out various things guys like i only use the first three things but you can use as always you can use everything you can analyze from various tools out there like these are the tools that i use and you can use anything of your choice So that's it guys that's it uh, how you can analyze the email headers I think you found this video helpful and this is also not only for digital forensics you can also uh, check whether the mail you got or uh, the mail you got is verified or not okay sometimes people get cheated for these kinds of mails like the mail it is showing here is for 4000 USD okay like it if you click on verify here it like it is showing it is a skeptical site okay if you click on that be asking you for some postal money or stuff okay and then that they will tell that they will provide you this to your bank and this 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 is nothing but cheating no one will give you money for free okay so and and by the help of this email header analysis you can put a check to these kinds of email spams okay so that's it guys for today and if you really like this video do like it and do share with your friends this is not only a hacking video but also an awareness video okay regarding spam and stuff and i hope you really like this video and this is satvik signing off and i'll meet you today at 8 30 pm with a live ctf out there do check that out as well guys really thank you for watching this video